Baptist Health has recently opened the Baptist Health Center for Clinical Research, located on the main Baptist Health campus in Little Rock. This new endeavor is taking Baptist Health into an important field of health care that often leads to improvements in the quality of lives for patients now and into the future. Now joining us uh, this afternoon is CEO of the center, Dr. Richard Pellegrino. Uh, joining us today, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you for, for having coming me. in. Tell us, tell us about your center. <clears throat> Well, we, uh, the Baptist Health Center for Clinical Research is located on uh, Mid Tower One, which is on campus. Uh, we are a multi-specialty uh, clinical research center, uh, so that we, at the moment, we're uh, operating approximately eight or ten different medical specialties. Um, uh, okay. Yeah. And okay. why did, I guess, Baptist Health decide to get a research center? Well, you know, clinical research is a uh, fairly large enterprise. There are, are studies now being done uh, around the world and um, this is how new drugs are developed. Yeah. The object was to increase our services to the to people in Little Rock. Uh, since these studies are done all over the world, if we can manage to attract these studies to Little Rock, it's a better service for our patients because they don't have to travel to have access to investigational medications. You mentioned eight to ten different areas. Can, can you tell us a little bit about maybe one or two of them that you're working on, or is that secret? No, it's not <laughs> a secret. <Okay>. Top, top, <laughs> secret top, top secret, Tom, we can't no, tell No, we, we don't have any dungeons uh, <laughs> okay. that I know of, anyway. Um, the uh, well, we're working in area right now. We're concentrating on men and women's health, uh, men's and women's health. For one, we have um, a study in endometriosis, which is a, uh, a disease that affects about 10 to 15 percent of women, causes pain, uh, increased bleeding, and uh, sometimes infertility. And we have uh, an investigational investigational medication that may uh, lessen pain uh, in that disease. We also uh, have a study in low T. Uh, for men, yeah, for men, and uh, apparently there are four or five million men in America uh, with this uh, problem, and this uh, this drug uh, hopefully will uh, increase the production of test natural production of testosterone in men. Yeah. Um, but we work in, in areas in neurology, in uh, rheumatology, rheumatoid arthritis, lupus things yeah. of that nature. Okay. And, and it kind of explain how the process works or if people or viewers are interested in participating, how would they get involved? Well, uh, when you call us, uh, we will uh, ask you a number of questions okay. uh, the, um, to see whether and answer your questions about the, about the study. So we'll tell you a little bit about the study, about what it entails, what your responsibilities are, what our responsibilities are and um, ask you some medical record questions because we need to know something about your medical history yeah. uh, to see whether you qualify. Uh, we'll probably ask to, for permission to look at your medical records at some point. If you qualify, then you come into the uh, office and we spend more time uh, going over the informed consent so that people understand exactly what they're getting into, uh, what the risks are, etc. Once you if you decide to proceed and, and, and you qualify for the study, uh, then you are placed in the study. And they usually last, they can last up to a couple of years, but usually they, they on average, they last three or four months and involve a series of visits. Uh, the visits are free, the medication's free, and patients uh, most, almost always are paid for time and travel. Oh, okay. Um, Sounds good. And if you at home would like so more information, I think we have a page we'll put up for you to call. Or, or to contact the folks over at Baptist. Right. I think we have it, or okay. we can have that. There it is, right there. One eight 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 Baptist. All right. Thanks so much, Dr. All Pellegrino. Right, thank you.